G'day guys, Spud from Survivor Southwest here. Uh, just out and about in the in the bushland around the southwest again. And today I'm just going to show you how to make a quick um, cage trap. Uh, just using a couple of bits of paracord, a whole pile of twigs. But before I do that, if you do like the content I'm putting out on my channel, make sure that you hit that subscribe button, hit the notification bell so you don't miss any of my upcoming videos. I usually post about once a week. And uh, be sure to hit the like button and share my videos around. Let's get into it. Okay, so what I've got here is I've got my base with two bits of uh, paracord. Already I'm making it a square. What I want to do is I want to cross that over in the middle and lay that down. Now as you can see here, I've got all my branches going from longest to shortest. Now what I want to do here is tuck them in, slide them right up to the end. Tuck it in slide them out bring in the next ones alternating the way those ones went tuck them in under the paracord slide them out and you'll notice that this paracord will start to get quite tight Now eventually it'll get to the point where you have to start rolling them out. Those ones are a bit big. And the smaller your, uh, smaller your branches are, the less gap there is going to be between the um, the bits of the cage. As I said, that paracord is going to get very tight. But that's the idea, that's what's going to hold this cage together. And basically, you finish off with one wedged between the two top and there we have it so that there is the cage part now you can make this cage as big or as small as you want depending on what you want to catch and as I said the thinner diameter your branches are the less gap there's going to be through here now we need to set up the trap part Okay, so now we've got our cage. I've set the trigger. Now the trigger is the same setup as a Paiute deadfall trap, which I have done a video on previously. So you've got your counterbalance down to a bit of paracord to the trigger toggle there. And then this one here is what's stopping that spinning around, releasing the trap. Now on here, I would put a bait. So when something 
comes along. And eats that bait. I've now caught myself something that I can eat. Okay, I'll show you again from the underside. Trigger stick, the paracord that goes up to the toggle there, which is counterbalancing on that. Little animal comes in, which I'll have a bait on here. And boom, caught. Alright guys, now that is a quick, simple little trap that you can use for catching birds or other live prey. Um, yeah, so if you, again, if you do like what I am putting out on my channel, be sure to hit that subscribe button. Um, hit the notification bell so you don't miss any of my upcoming videos. I usually post once a week. If there's anything you want me to do a video on, put it in the comments below and I'll see what I can do. And don't forget to like and share, and I'll see you next time.